Hello, I'm back again to talk about um, role play or imaginary play. Um, now, I'm sure if uh, your child likes role play or imaginary play, you've seen over the past couple of weeks all of the different wonderful places that your child is playing in. And um, maybe they're trying to get you involved or trying to get older young people in your house involved. And I know that they can feel a bit silly to take part in role play. So I've got a couple of tips. First of all, wait to be invited. Uh, don't just jump in. Uh, you know, they, they might be perfectly happy playing in their, their own world on their own. But if they do invite you in, uh, maybe a prop will help you. So a bag or a hat might help you feel a little bit less silly. Um, and let your child lead the play. So don't take over. You know, if they've invited you in to play shops, don't take over the shop. Um, let them lead that play and lead and lead you into role play. Um, if you wanted to create some role play spaces for your children in your house because I know the idea of the cinema went down really well and um, then I've just thought of some extra things that you could do so going back to the cinema you could add in some extra play there by using cardboard boxes or laundry baskets and getting your children to turn them into cars then you could do a drive-in cinema in front of the telly so you could host the drive-in cinema um, and serve popcorn or, or something like that or some crisps uh, in the cars um, you could also host a dinner party, so you could set a day and a time for your children to know that you're going to be hosting a special dinner party. Um, everyone could get dressed up. Uh, you could host a party like you normally would uh, in the comfort of your own home and the people that are in your house. Um, or you could also host a like a posh tea party for lunch. So you could extend on this by um, putting invitations outside your children's doors, uh, telling them the, the time and the place that the tea party is going to happen within your house. Um, it'll give them sort of something to look forward to throughout the day and maybe get dressed up and make costumes for as well. Um, I hope these help. And if you have any ideas about role play in your house, uh, then please share them with us so we can carry on sharing all of your wonderful ideas too.